up? We are here at uh, Carson Trolls house. We, we just started filming a video for that truck. I'm sure y'all have already seen that. It was uploaded about two weeks ago by the time you're seeing this. But uh, while we're here, we got his buddy Carter Thomas here with his Ranger. So we're gonna go ahead and go over a full build review on his truck and then probably go get some rollers in a couple hours uh, after we finish this video with Carson. And uh, we're just gonna go over everything. He's gonna tell you all about it and then uh, we'll catch you in the rollers. All right. So for the front, I got the clears with switchbacks and just normal LEDs last fit or something yeah yeah that's what i got and i got i had to get a new bumper because i wrecked this truck a long time ago i went to i went somewhere and i came back at night or came back in the morning and either fell asleep or was just going to the <laughs> off control i got you and it bent it and like so i had to get a new one yeah right here, I, um well what year is it let's go over that oh one so it's two wheel drive but you don't two. see very well some people do it, but you can't really. This is about the biggest you can get them without doing anything haggardy. Yeah, yeah. So does it have a lift, or you just got like keys and spindles or something it like that? It has pulls, actually. That's, that's oh. the hard part about it. That's why nobody can get them bigger. Right? I understand. I, I don't, I don't know nothing about that. so bad. It drives bad. Yeah. But um, I've got four inch spindles, a three inch pull puck. Um, oh, I see. A three inch body, and I've got those take uppers. I haven't seen anybody with a those take uppers. But, I know a lot of people run BTF. Oh, yeah. They're like $800 for the whole thing, but they're uniball, so you never have to replace them. And to run a cool spacer on these trucks, you have to get camber bolts, uh -huh. aftermarket camber bolts, so yeah. you can slide them out further. And you have to get the lift shocks, too. But they, they don't make the ones that I have anymore, but they have something similar to it. Yeah. Well, we got wheel wise right here. I got These. fours and threes, split sixes on rugged terrain patriots i thought they were sixes i didn't even know this. they look stupid big it's yeah it's a tiny truck yeah it looks ridiculous i don't know i feel like if you had sixes on it it probably look like you're riding around on 28s <laughs> but if you put 28s on it yeah. that might that might break like the internet like wagon wheels for real yeah I know, yeah uh, jacob taylor some people in the video might know him but he had some eights and they looked yeah no Oh, yeah, Isaac Carter had one. Yeah, Isaac Carter had 30 or 20 inches. It was huh. stupid. And his was on the pie. His was like the same as mine, but he had a C notch. And it was. Dang. I, don't know, it was I like gotta see this thing. Or something. Anyways, uh, got color match mirrors. These come off of. I'm not really sure what model, but I don't know. I just got them because I like the chrome cap and I was yeah. gonna get mine color match anyways. Mm -hmm. A lot of people ask about this. And I've gatekeeped it for a while, but I'm just <laughs> gonna tell y'all what I did. I got, it, it was peeling at first. All of the factory Ranger ones are black. Yep. At first, like that one over there. Uh -huh. Did you peel it all off the other day or no? There's still black stuff like right here. You can see it. Oh, no, you can't, it's off. But, um, that, I got chrome mirror, or chrome door handles, caddy racks. A lot of people ask about those. I know me and one of my buddies from Hamilton are the only ones that have them on Rangers. Matt Chan. Third brake light in the back, it's a three inch body, but there's a leaf pulled, so it's like positive two. Okay, like okay, we got the I think Amazon or something chrome tail lights. Um, the stunt wall is yeah. two Tempano mid base, two 10 inch DS18 Pro mids, uh, eight DS18 Pro mid. Up in the corners up there. I took the throat off of the horn and oh, just mounted them straight to the wood. Yeah. And it makes it, I mean, it's, it's not that much different. It's just not as a direct sound. Uh -huh. It's more like everywhere you can yeah, really yeah. hear it. Or you can hear it, but it's more. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Be standing directly behind the stump wall just ripped up. Yeah, yeah. If you, if you, put it, a, it, if you have it. a six inch throat on the horn, if you're, if you're standing out to the side, God, yeah, it doesn't carry it as much. It, like, I can stand back there with the throats on it uh -huh. here at clear as day, but you get kind of further back and it gets a little bit quieter, yeah. but it's still stupid. Like, you like sacrifice it, like spread the sound wider rather than straight out. Mm -hmm. I wish I could get this stunt wall flush with this, yeah. but the way this bed cover is, it's got these little latch right here. Oh, I got you. Yeah, scoot it back so you can open it. What brand bed covers are? I don't know, it's off eBay. They're really Just hard eBay. to find. Yeah. I, I have a link for it, I think. I don't, they're hard to find because they don't, on the eBay thing, it shows a completely different truck than what it actually goes really? on. It just says the title and all that. Huh. 
That's weird. The amps for the wall is all the all the mid the mid bass are ran off a of tempano 1400 by one, mm -hmm. and the horns are on a Tarrant 440 by four. Gosh, Let's check out this interior. <laughs> um, on the interior, I got uh, I think it's a 530 Starlight. Oh, yeah. Sure. But, and then I got, I gave keep this a lot too. The seats come out of a Nissan Armada Platinum. A lot of people really? think of an F 150 just because they're platinum. Everybody sees F 150. Well, yeah. uh, I dyed the carpet with right or what is it? Some kind of dye, some black yeah. dye. Yeah. And there's all the amps and everything. The wires kind of. I got you. But I got a just a little 12 for mm -hmm. the subs, just a little something. Oh, like I see. Don't. That's where mine are mounted, my amps are on the wall. Yeah. And you can see like screws through the he, back of it. He had an amp rack for a while, and I thought I wanted to do that, but I've that later. Uh -huh. Yeah, I've seen that console. Did he make and, the same one that makes yours? No. Me and my dad built that one, actually. It's pretty nice. It is nice. And then on the cluster, you may not be able to see it because it's time, but it's a LED cluster. Not LED, but I just scraped You can take those out, take the faceplate off of uh -huh. them. And then get a alcohol on a rag. Yeah. You just wipe the green stuff off of it, and hmm. it comes clean like that. But you can kind of see it right there on the bottom. That's how it was before on the whole thing. Oh yeah, I see it right here. Let me see the rest. I got you. It's clean though. Yeah. You got an exhaust on it, or is it is it stock? It had a bot, or I had a, I put a body lift on it. Uh huh. And I hated the way it looked. So it used to come out. It was like a pencil tip. It looked stupid. Really? It like came out right here, and it was. Probably like two inches wide, so I just cut it back there so you couldn't see it. Maybe I got you. The tent. Yeah. Everybody's yeah. probably gonna flame me for the tent, but cops have hold me religiously over anything. So I had to get 35. Oh, yeah, I see. And I've never gotten a tent ticket. Yeah, well, I've, 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 I've got the only reason it's like absolutely fish rolling right now is because it has brand new windows and a brand new windshield. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. Like, and I obviously ain't been able to drive it since I've got it back from painting everything. So that's the only reason I don't have anything on it. I gosh. Yeah, I got, I think I just put five on the sides mm -hmm. and the back, all that crap. And I got 20 on the, sh no, 15 on the shield. That's what I was going to do. I was going to be five everywhere and then 20. That's yeah. what I used to have. My old windows, my dad, that was my dad's truck, and he used to like mud ride it, dog, mm -hmm. and all that. And they had like really bad hard scratches in the windows, and I couldn't stand that, so I'd get the windows for it. Yeah. Yeah, like that right there. So now I'm like 10 times that. Yeah, I got scratches on mine too. Bro. Radio is a uh, Kenwood BMX 470 07S or something. Yeah. Uh, in the doors. On the doors, it has. In the front, it's just a BS18 mid. Just, mm -hmm. Or no, it's a mid base. And in the back, I just put a mid or a mid base in the back. I got you. Or no, a normal mid in the back. Yes. And they're just ran straight off the radio, no amp on or anything. I got you. Yeah, my door speakers stopped working the other day because I, I guess I blew my amp that was ran to my door speakers. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get this stunt wall real quick. Look at Carson's truck in the back. What's all you want? Uh, something's not copyrighted. Uh, I don't, I don't know what, like last time I did one of these, I had to cut out like half the video of the stunt wall because it, it was copyrighted. Hey, that ain't bad. Loud. Got grumpy pants over there in the car because she thinks it's too cold outside. That's loud though. I might have to get with these boys whenever I decide to do audio stuff like that because I don't know nothing about it. Obviously, they, they know a good bit about it. That's loud. It's got a nice mixture of bass and, and mid range in it.
gonna be the end of this video i hope you guys did enjoy carter's truck uh all the rollers and stuff all the stuff he went over uh if y'all guys want to follow him where can they find you at all right make sure y'all make sure y'all hit that like button and uh i don't know if we've hit 25 or 1500 on uh, youtube yet but if we haven't go ahead and hit that subscribe button before the end of 2024 and uh we'll see you guys in the next video